Hello guys and girls, welcome back. I just made a video, but today while I was shooting some other guns, um, I got my daughter an early Christmas present, and it is a fixed power scope for her Cricut rifle, which is also made by Cricut. I believe it is a four by 32 millimeter uh, scope. Like I said, it's fixed power. So basically I, what I did was a couple years ago for a present, I don't remember if it was a Christmas present or a birthday present, I bought her this gun. I think that she was four. She might have been five, but I think that she was four. Maybe I'm wrong, she might have been five. So I bought her the gun, even though it's as small as it is, I have a small child, so it was still a little bit big for her. Um, the gun is actually in total um, about, let's see, here. If I can get this on there, you gotta see. The gun is 30 inches long. Um, the barrel on there is 15 and a quarter inches about. Um, and I'm not quite sure what, what the twist rate is. I think it's one in 16 if I had to guess, maybe one in 13. Um, it is a single shot rifle. You have to put one in at a time. Um, it operates really well, it's pretty user friendly, not very hard to understand at all. Pretty much what you gotta do with it is obviously got a little hole in there, take one bullet, put it in there, close the bolt, put it on fire, pull this back, take it off of fire. I guess one thing you could do is squeeze the trigger and slowly let that go forward. Kind of like a, a hammer on a sh uh, single shot type of deal there. Um, but it does have a heavy trigger, like a super heavy trigger. I would guess probably close to five pounds maybe maybe four, four or five pounds for a kid that's pretty heavy, but it is what it is. Um, the scope itself did come with the scope rings and they're kind of high, it's mounted high off the gun. This is also um, the scope base that I ordered for this gun. You have to have the exact one. It's got some weird stuff that kind of goes along with it and how it works and things like that, but it is very accurate, let me tell you. This is why I'm making the video is because I was impressed with the gun. I literally put the scope on there, and this could be a fluke, it's just how it happened. Put the scope in the gun after my daughter opened the present this morning. She loved it, Was a, right away was ready to go shoot it. I installed the scope in there for her, we went out to the range, and when it came her time to shoot, I put the, the scope on there, and um, I took the first shot, um, I'm not exactly sure why. I don't know if she wanted to or whatever, but I went ahead and done that. I shot at 50 yards at a berm behind the targets at our local range. And on the berm, I had a clay pigeon that another guy from that was there shooting that day that was nice enough to let me said, take whatever you want. So I grabbed, I think, three or four of them and put them out there. The first shot, without ever touching the scope or setting anything, I hit the clay pigeon and busted it. So uh, my daughter from there, she using that Caldwell 7 rest that I just had in the last video, took a few shots and hit some clay pigeons and she was really happy with that. At 50 yards y'all, with a you know 15 inch barrel and this Federal ammunition, it's called Federal Auto Match. I got it the other day, it was actually for a really good price. I think I paid like $28 for 325 rounds. We probably shot it 40 or 50 times today. And she had maybe more than that. She had a great time. The gun shot great. I actually have a box that, uh, to show you all kind of what the grouping looked like at 25 yards. Some of her shots, and she's not the very best. She's just six, and she's doing her best. She's still trying to figure out eye relief and how to keep, um, you know, her left eye shut since she's right-handed and using the right eye and, you know, the coordinate, the, the hand-eye coordination. She's still figuring out, but. I told her to aim at this and she's pulling, she's not squeezing the trigger. So she got three shots over here. And um, she also did this shot, this shot, this shot aiming at this. I got, before I messed with the scope at all, I got these four here at 25 yards. And then I reset the scope, I pulled this shot and I put two touching each other right there in the middle of the dot there. I mean, the, the gun shoots great. It is a shooter. So, oh, it looks, oh, it looks like she also got some shots down here. So, and she also got some kind of tearing up the side of the box somewhere. There we go. But she loved it. She had a great time. So as long as you were supervising a kid, you know, I definitely 
uh, would be like, hey man, get your kid a cricket rifle. There's also this other rifle by Savage, which is a bit nicer than this one. The bolt operates differently too. It's uh, more of a, the bolt actually throws the shell out and, you know, picks it up. You know, you ain't got to put the shell into the chamber. It picks it up off of like a ramp and puts it in there. All you got to do is put the shell into the you know, loading area there and it picks it up on its own. It also has a different firing method. And it's also just like a, like a really nice, they come, some of them cool, come with a really nice wooden stock. They're just a really attractive gun. But uh, they are a bit cheap, more expensive. I think like seventy-five dollars more to a hundred dollars more than this. I think I was, this gun was about one hundred and twenty bucks or something like that. But I do not regret it at all. Like I, I'm pretty sure here within the next couple of years, she's going to start killing squirrels with it. And the more that she shoots it, the more that she'll like it. And this is a type of Christmas present that I think that parents should get their kids. Even if you don't agree with a gun, you, there's other things you can get them that they will enjoy doing outside, like bicycle and things like that. But if you're watching this channel, you're most likely interested because you're interested in this gun and you want to get one for your kid or for yourself. You know, they are a little bit uh, kind of tricky for a big person like me to shoot. I'm six feet tall and weigh 240 pounds. So, you know, this isn't something that I'm going to you know, ride around with, but you know, she does like it and she's so super happy to have a rifle that has a scope on it. And she's like, his daddy is just like your gun. And the thing shoots great. You know, it's not a toy, which is really cool. And she's always going to have this and one day hopefully give it to her kid. You know, there are some upgrades for these. There's also one that comes kind of with a McMillan style stock and a heavy barrel. Uh, that looks really, that looks, just looks really cool. I think it also has a muzzle brake on it, if I'm not mistaken. Um, and it looked great. I think it actually comes with a scope. Um, but this is the, my first ri rifle by Cricket. They're actually made by another company. I don't remember what it was, but, um, it's a great gun. If you have any other questions on these, or I'm sure there's probably tons of video on this, but I just really wanted to post that this video because I shot it and I liked it and she had a super awesome time shooting it. Also, like I said, Two things I don't like about the gun is this thing that you pull on here has this little part connected to the metal is plastic. I'm kind of afraid that that might break at some point, but I'm hoping that it doesn't. If it does, I'm pretty sure that there's a way to get a replacement. Also, the trigger is super heavy, but she did not say, hey, dad, it's hard for me to pull the trigger. She was able to do it. And I think the heavier trigger pull lends more to less accidents happening, if, happening, if you know what I mean. Like a child won't accidentally pull the trigger you know, unless they're intentionally putting force on it. Like they won't barely touch it and it go off at the wrong time with maybe people downrange or anything like that. Um, I think that it's good that the trigger is heavy, but at the same time, me as an adult shooter, I don't like it. But it is what it is. She had a great time. Also, the finish on this gun um, is a good blue. Like, I am not lying, y'all. The gun the, it is made well. Like, the gun is a good gun. So, hopefully, uh, it continues to be a good gun. I'm sure it will. And, uh, like I said, fixed power scope. Can't go wrong with that. It's a four power. And um, I hope that this is something that y'all consider if y'all are wanting to get something like this for your kids. The one by Savage is called The Rascal. So if you are interested in maybe something a little bit higher quality, uh, the Savage Rascal 22 rifle might be more up your alley. But if you are looking for a scope, you can get this Cricket rifle scope. You can look for it on Amazon. Maybe eBay has them brand new. Uh, I paid $60 at a local gun store for it, but I think you could possibly get them for a little bit cheaper than that. They are a good scope. Like the glass is clear. You know, there isn't any type of, um, you know, a mirage, mirage look or any type of distortion. There's just a clear glass, good scope, nice classic crosshair, and it did a great job. And like I said, biggest part, my daughter loved it and she had a good time. So anyways, hope that y'all like the video. As always, like and subscribe, man, because this I love doing this. So hopefully y'all enjoyed the video. Like I said, God bless you. Jesus loves you. Have a great day.